Welcome guys to my channel. Today I'm going to review this Taylor programmable wired probe thermometer and it's a USDA uh, preset temperature. It has a backlight, cord storage, timer trains is to 99.59 and uh, you can uh, track the food and temperatures uh, without uh, opening the uh, oven. <clears throat> so let me open this up and let's see. Okay, uh, you can get this uh, from uh, Walmart. I just bought it uh, from Walmart for uh, $19. Just got this on the shelf. And uh, once you open the, uh, the packaging, so it has a uh, manual. So my hands are a little bit dirty because I prep my. Uh, as you see, I already uh, prepared my uh, smoking grill. This is a Dynaglow. And uh, this is my uh, beep. I already seasoned it with the chip Mahormic uh, uh, brown sugar and a garlic and some uh, seasoning. <clears throat> And uh, this is what you see, guys, uh, once you open the, uh, the instruction manual. So it's a model number 5257579. It's a digital cooking temperature. <clears throat> so as you see, so through this is in, uh, manual, there's instructions uh, getting started. There is a static uh, clean label over the LCD. Please remove before use. And this thermometer operates with the two uh, AAA alkaline batteries included. Remove any plastic wrap from the batteries before proceeding. And some units may be uh, instead have a plastic strip and a battery cover, so on and so forth. <clears throat> so this is the actual unit at the back of the uh, thermometer the probe so it has a uh, on and off switch on the side so you are able to choose uh, either the celsius or the uh, fahrenheit and there's hold a on. back hint hold on let me check insurance <coughs> so you need to uh, remove this uh, plastic uh, protective layer to the top of this uh, tailor <coughs> probe and as you see it has a mode hour and a minimum setting and at the back you need to slide this and you are able to uh, put the uh, the triple a battery so they provided the triple a battery all you need to do is just uh, remove this uh, plastic uh, uh, packaging to this uh, AAA battery. Let me try to remove it. This is the uh, first time that I just uh, got this uh, type of uh, thermometer. I use the uh, old school analog thermometer. And let me see how this thing works once I uh, put the battery at the back. So I'm gonna put the battery. So I'm gonna put the other uh, battery as well. So I need to uh, place it back this uh, back cover. So when you place it back. <coughs> So this is the uh, probe, so the probe uh, should go to the side, so that's the side, you can see it to the right side, so you need to, uh, you need to put this in, this uh, mill uh, jack to the side of this uh, probe, okay let me put it in. I 
ready for it in so let's turn it on let's see how this thing works okay so there's an on and off switch on the side this timer temperature so I will set it on the power to the apparent height <clears throat> and that's what you see uh, right now uh, the thermal temperature is uh, 63 degrees Fahrenheit uh, because uh, right now is a uh, fall season and that's the uh, uh, right temperature approximately uh, to uh, 60 degrees Fahrenheit so setting the uh, temperature because this is a beep so beep uh, basically uh, you you have a lot of options or you have three options that you will choose for your beep if you want a uh, rare uh, beep so you could set it at 240 degrees uh, Fahrenheit the medium rare is 145 the well done is 170 degrees so setting the uh, <coughs> setting the temperature so you can lower this So I would like to uh, set it to uh, medium rare. So I'll set it to 145. Okay. And the hours. So you can set it to the hours as well if you want it. So, if you guys want to uh, increase the uh, uh, Fahrenheit, so this is the upper bottom and this is the lower bottom, as you see. So, I want to set it to 145, the mode. <clears throat> so, once you press this, so it's going to start up uh, the uh, temperature. Now, oh, there you go. So, they will uh, ask you uh, which options are you going to choose uh, in this. So, so like what I said, uh, you know, this is a uh, medium, so I click on the upper uh, middle uh, button, so it's a medium, so once you set it to medium, so you need to click this uh, arrow, so that you're able to set it. Now it's already been set, I'm gonna set this to... Uh, the temperature to uh, 145 degrees. Oh, no, no, 145 degrees. I want to meet you more. Okay. Set it to hum. I'm gonna set it to uh, oh, this one. I'm gonna set it to uh, medium. So, medium, uh, they set it uh, by itself to 160 degrees. Now it's already been set up to uh, 160 degrees Fahrenheit for a medium rail. Uh, so, that's how you guys uh, use it. So all you need to do, you need to just stick this inside to the meat and uh, put your uh, meat inside your uh, smoke grill. Like what I said, uh, you know, I have a uh, dyno glow and uh, I already uh, set this up to 160 degrees uh, medium there. So I hope you guys uh, learn and how to use uh, this uh, Taylor. This is a uh, not expensive uh, thermometer or which is a programmable wired uh, probe uh, thermometer. Uh, you can get this only for $19. Uh, 
and uh, the good thing with this the monitor it monitor the exact temperatures of meat poultry or any food without opening the uh, open box. alarm signal and then preset cooking time or when the desired internal uh, food temperatures it's we show the perfect result and it has a standard display for counter uh, use so you need to be cautious with this because this thermometer probe will become hot uh, during the use uh, in oven or in your uh, smoke grill and handle uh, with the heat resistance protections when removing the probe. Do not place a digital uh, base in oven or grill. And uh, cleaning the uh, cleaning with care, uh, do not immerse the uh, thermometer in water and not for use in this washer. Clean the probe portions only with hot water and soap and wipe it with cold uh, casing uh, with damp cloth. So it comes with the one year warranty, so you won't get wrong with this uh, for, one, uh, for uh, $19. You can buy this from Walmart. Till next time, guys. I hope you guys uh, keep watching my channel. May you guys have a wonderful weekend. Uh, Today is uh, weekend, Saturday, 11 of uh, uh, November uh, 5th. And it's a fall season. So it's a bare month. It's a really cold here in Las Vegas, Nevada. As you see, the thermometer probe, uh, it's reaching to uh, 63 degrees Fahrenheit. So I hope you guys learn how to use this uh, thermometer probe, which is made by Taylor. May you guys have a wonderful weekend. Uh, kindly share, subscribe to my YouTube channel. May God bless you all.